Richard didn't see these items here left on the like jewelry. Yes? Apparently, oh my god, they look nice. Someone has left three coiled bracelets there. Uh -huh. And they look like snakes. Uh -huh. And you may get a curse in your life simply for picking up this jewelry. So that is how serious it is, yeah? Uh -huh. That it is so isolated in a day like this. Someone is just passing by. And when they are not aware, they say, oh my God, how beautiful. Someone has actually leaving, left this wonderful jewelry. And I'm going to use it. And then you are cursed by three snakes that you have put around your, even the fact that you collected, collect them, can give you a curse. And you bring them to your house, not knowing at all that they are going to destroy your life, that they are demons in disguise. And then you get a massive situation there, a curse, a problem, a demon that will try to destroy you, to still kill and destroy in all sorts of ways. So it's just an example of how easy it is to be caught up in this world. Just, these are the snares. And if you are not well informed, and if you already don't see that they are cursed jewelry, or that they are, have the potential to mislead you from your eternal destination, then you pick them up, you don't think twice about that, you think, oh, how generous the person just was leaving them there. It has happened many times for me. I collected, used to collect a lot of things left on the streets, yeah? And you become very picky. And if you want to find out more about this, try to check the videos in the description with amazing testimonies and amazing children of God that explain this very well in detail. Blessings to all of you and activate the love gene.